Hey guys, Duncan Dark here. Thanks for joining me on Must We Devour. Today we're going to be checking out my very first Halloween haul. Happy October, guys. I hope you enjoy it. Let's check this shit out. Alright guys, so as I like to do, we'll start from the smallest item and work our way up. Let's check them out. First item from the thrift store. Pumpkin. Flashlight. Hey, if we need a flashlight, we want to bring something out on Halloween night or the nights before Halloween. Ah, fuck, I just fucked that up. Got it at the thrift store. Hey, it was 99 cents. So, I don't even know if it works yet. I didn't put any batteries in it yet. But hey, if we need a flashlight for Halloween night, that'll be nice to, to use, won't it? Okay, so, I seem real excited about that one. Anyway, we got some vintage Halloween lights. I mean, I don't know how old these are. They're really yellowed. Maybe they're from the 90s. Um, they do work. Plugged them in already. And uh, yeah, so those are the vintage lights that we picked up. Another thrift store find. Now we will go on to these guys. These I picked up at Spirit Halloween. Hey, they were cute. Little clown characters. And that guy, he's got a much better laugh on him. Oh well, yeah, Spirit Halloween. A couple dollars each for those. They've had them for years. I think they're blowing them out finally. And next thing up from the thrift store as well is this ghostly woman head. It lights up. I'm not sure how well you're gonna be able to see that. Probably can see it a little bit. But here's a couple dollars. Face on it look cool. Maybe I can use it for something, you know, with another prop or I will, we'll figure something out with this thing. So that was the ghostly woman head. We picked up a couple of creepy looking black painted picture frames. And those were two for $1.99, so pretty good there, thrift store. And we got, it's something that you can put candy in. Happy Halloween. Opens up, grab the candy, closes back up. Eyes light up, and uh, yeah, that was I think that was four dollars, three ninety nine at the thrift store. Okay, so we only have a few items left now, but I will be doing more Halloween haul videos, so watch for those coming up in the next few days, hopefully. We got this dead head. So just a hanging foam filled latex head and severed, kind of mummified looking, really cool. Thrift store, 10 bucks, not too bad for that. Now for the next item, it's quite silly, but I figured, hey, why not put it on for you guys? It looks ridiculous on. It's another thing from the thrift store. I know my hair probably looks like hell. Anyway, there we go. Don't matter what my hair looks like now, does it? So we got that. Goes around your head. Hope I don't rip these gloves, but we'll get these gloves on and it's going to complete the werewolf look that so many people strive for at Halloween to have a costume this good. Get yourself out to the thrift stores, maybe you could find something like this. Anyway, thought I'd try it on for you, give you guys a little bit of a laugh, hopefully. There it is. Let's get the hat back on. And now, for the final, well, I'll show you that mask again, because that's what I got. 
at another thrift store. These finds have been amazing this year, but I've been checking like almost every day, going to about four or five of them a day. So, pick that guy up. Paper Magic Group, the Shriner Skull Mask. Really cool. And the final item. Hey, I might as well try this one on too. It's another mask. I believe this one's called Sir Francis Bacon. And there he is. So, really cool find, Sir Francis Bacon. I mean, that's an awesome mask. Really freaky, the monocle's weird, the hat's weird. Nothing's weird about this thing. So that's why I picked it up. And he was $15, so not a bad deal at all. Thanks so much for watching, guys. Hope to see you on the next Halloween haul video. Stay horrified.